I'm going to read a paragraph International Mother Language Day. International Mother Language Day, popularly known as Shahid Divas, is a red letter day in our history. In 1952, on this day, a number of our brave sons laid down their life in cause of Bangla language. The UNESCO declared 21st February as the International Mother Language Day, showing respect to the motives of our language movement. This declaration has turned into a national celebration to the international event. Every year on this day, people from all walks of life come to the Matis Memorial and offer their homage. Hundreds of people barefooted gathered in front of Shahid Minar with flowers and garlands. It's our national holiday. Schools, colleges, universities, and offices remain closed on this day. Actually, the day possesses a great significance for the whole nation as well as whole world. So, that was the total paragraph. And I'm repeating uh, some lines uh, that will be easy for you to practice. First of all, International Mother Language Day, popularly known as Shahid Dibash, is a red letter day in our history. The first, the first line is talking about the popularly known. What is actually popularly known? The day is actually popularly known as Shahid Dibash, and it is a red letter day in our history. A uh, red letter day that means a significance day in our history. So, in 1952, on this day, a number of our brave sons laid down their life in cause of Bangla language. So, uh, we can see. Uh, some of our sons um, laid, la laid down their life, laid down, that means sacrifices their life uh, in, uh, in cause of Bangla language. The UNESCO declared 21st February as the International Mother Language Day. So, which organization? UNESCO actually declared 21st February as the International Mother Language Day. Why? Because of showing respect to the matis of our language movement. So, this declaration has turned into a national celebration to the international event. So, after the declaration from the UNESCO, this day actually turned from the national celebration to the international event. So, every year on this day, people from all walks of life uh, come to the Matis Memorial and offer their homage. Homage, that means they have uh, the respect respect uh, uh, they come to the Mat uh, Matis memorial uh, to show respect uh, to uh, to the um, to the sons who laid down laid down their life for the country hundreds of people barefooted gathered in front of shahid minar with flowers and garlands so we can see that uh, on this day uh, on this significant day we see the the peoples from uh, from all uh, from from all works they Mm, they comes they come to uh, barefooted and gather together and show their respect by offering flowers and garlands it's our national holiday so it's our national holiday so on this day schools colleges universities and offices remain closed actually the days possess a great significance for the whole nation as well as the whole world now i'm going to some going to read some vocabularies that we found from the paragraph the vocabs like UNESCO first one is UNESCO the, to, uh, the full meaning of this uh, UNESCO is that United Nations is occasional scientific and cultural organization so this organization actually declared our 21st February as the International Mother Language Day second one is that a red letter day memorable specially important or happy so, red letter day means memorable or special important. Brave, that means having or showing mental or moral strength to face danger, fear or difficulty. Lay down, give up or surrender. Matis, one who sacrifices his life or suffer in order to get freedom. Declare, make a public and typically formal announcement or notice about a fact event a thing that happens specially one of importance homage special honor 
or respect shown publicly. Barefooted, wearing nothing on the feet. Barefooted means wearing nothing on the feet. Galens, a chain of flowers and leaves used for decoration. Significance, the quality of being important of attention or importance. Thank you very much. That was for today. Bye-bye.